Hey there people, Peter here back with another video for you. And this time around I decided to do something a little bit different. I had a theory and I decided to test it. Ok, my theory was that more fans at lower speeds will cool just as well as less fans at higher speed, but they will be quieter. Basically the gist is that more fans will create better airflow inside the case without making as much noise. The idea is that one fan creates let's say 15 decibels of noise, but two fans don't create 30 decibels. This is not how the sound works. However, if one fan moves 50 cubic feet of air, two fans will move 100 cubic feet. So the slight increase in noise will effectively double the airflow. But if we lower down the speed of the fans, that will kill the noise. And even if it halves the airflow, if it cuts it at half from 100 back to 50, it will be still the same airflow as one fan, but it will be much quieter. So back in the day when I needed a new PC case, I got myself Fractal Design Arc MIDI R2. It comes by default with three fans but I added two extra making the total fan count in the case to five. Having a dual fan CPU cooler and a triple fan GPU and by adding in the power supply fan the total fan count in my system is 11 but having five case fans allows me to make a small pile of stress tests in order to see how wrong or how right my theory actually is. So I took some time, I made some sound tests, I made some stress tests and recorded everything. All tests are made on the same system which is actually my personal system. The specs don't really matter, the important part in this test is how the thermals and the noise changes according to the fan count and the fan speed. All case fans are Fractal Design Silent Series R2 fans 140 mm. You can see the specifications of those fans on the screen right now. I would like to aim your attention to the air pressure of 0.84 mm. This is at maximum speed, but I would like you to remember this thing. The case itself comes with fan controller for three fans and the other two fans are controlled by my motherboard and by its visually buggy software. I checked the fans though, it's just the visuals that are fucked up. The fan control on the motherboard is working just fine. So there we go. Now with that out of the way I gathered all results in this convenient graph. Interesting fact is that the GPU thermals are almost constant, no matter the increase in the airflow or the fan speed or whatever. The GPU just do not give a fuck. Yes, there is a slight difference between 5 fans at 12 volts and 3 fans at 5 volts, but come on. 3 degrees Celsius, this is barely a difference when the range is near the 70 degrees. Another interesting fact that I think needs some attention is that having 5 fans even at lower speeds kept my motherboard cool. I needed to crank up the 3 fans up to 12 volts in order to have the motherboard as cool as it was with 5 fans even at the lowest 5 volt speed. Now with that out of the way, direct proof of my theory are those two test results. 5 fans at 5 volts and 3 fans at 7 volts. The thermal performance is exactly the same, but the 5 fan configuration is slightly quieter. This actually really helps during the night. Another slightly different proof 
of the same thing are those two tests, the 5 fans at 7 volts and the 3 fans at 12 volts. The only difference is the CPU temperature, but this is easily fixable with just a slight change in the CPU fan curve. The noise, however, in the 3 fan configuration is noticeably louder. I would like to point something just so we're clear. In everyday use scenario, there is something called noise pollution. It's the sound that is made by a different aperture in the office, or people on the streets, or vehicles, or just whatever. There is always some level of noise pollution, but during the day with all the people's active and whatnot, the sound pollution is noticeably louder. The daily sound pollution will cancel all noises around 20 decibels. So to be honest, unless you're extremely noise sensitive freak like me, you will not notice the difference between the 19 decibels and 22 decibels in everyday use. However, you will notice the difference between 22 decibels and 29 decibels. 29 is loud. It is audible. You can hear it clearly. It is way louder than the everyday noise pollution. Before we wrap up, I would like to bring your attention to one extra test that I decided to make. I used the 5 fans at 7 volt configuration. The only difference is that I removed the front intake dust filter. I love my Arc Midi R2. It is one of the best cases ever made. I would like to make that perfectly clear. I also love the dust filters as well. The fact that I don't really need to clean this thing more than once a year makes me really happy. Brings a smile to my face. However, the fan filters are thick foam type. They are really, really restrictive when it comes to airflow. And this is where, if you remember in the beginning of the video, the fan static pressure comes in place. The Silent Series R2 fans from Fractal cannot push or pull in this case enough air through any obstacle whatsoever. And if you check the results, the front dust filter proves to be quite an obstacle. Everything has lower thermals, even the GPU that have not shown any sign of change. And this is just a dust filter. Imagine what a completely closed off run of the case can actually do for the airflow. Something like the NZXTH440 or the Fractal Design R4 or R5. Those things literally kill the airflow, especially if the fans behind it are not strong enough. I would like to remind everybody that a warmer components will be even more sensitive to the airflow in the case. 50 degrees Celsius under stress for a CPU is actually ice cold. Many CPUs reach 80 or even 90 degrees. I could have taken some time to make extra tests with only two fans and different fan placements and whatnot, but I think the results are obvious. I mean, less fans will raise the temperatures even higher and will not really change the sound much, so I see no point. The best thing you can do for your system is just add a couple of extra fans and set them all on lower speed and allow your entire system to breathe freely. I'd like to see your thoughts in the comment section down below and I'll see you in the next video. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, why don't you click the like button down below? If you did not, well the dislike button is right next to it. Hit me up on Twitter and subscribe to my channel for more videos similar to this one. See ya.